So I don't know about you guys, but every time I see a fake-ass faith healer debunked and embarrassed on national television, I just get as happy as a little girl. Case in point, this story that's been going viral in India over the last couple months, where this fucking legend embarrassed and humiliated two fake-ass con men live on national television in India. Now these dudes are speaking some kind of gobbledygook Indian language that you won't understand, so I'm going to translate. Basically, these fucking idiots are like, yeah, man, we're totally magical. We do what we call no-touch, no-medicine healing. We can just heal you with the magic of our energy. If you pay us money, we can actually heal you through the phone. And this dude's like, bitch, you're fucking lying. How the hell are you going to heal somebody through a goddamn telephone? And then they're like, trust us, dude. We can heal people with their magical energy through the telephone. As long as you pay us, of course. Really? Let me ask you a question then. If you have magical powers to heal yourself, then are you in super fucking good shape right now? And the dude's like, hells yeah. And so the skeptic is like, men your age who are South Asian often have high blood pressure. Do you have high blood pressure? And the con man's like, fuck no, I ain't got no goddamn high blood pressure. I'm magical, bitch. So then the skeptical dude live on fucking national television whips out a fucking blood pressure machine. And he's like, prove it, slut. And so what's this con man gonna do? He's been trapped live on television. Now he's gotta fucking do it. So he puts on this really obvious fake grin on his face and pretends like he's actually happy to do it. But you can tell he ain't happy to do it. So he lets the guy take his blood pressure and the machine goes off. And his blood pressure is 185 over 103, which is high as fucking shit, man. That is serious. And so the skeptic is like, see, bitch, I told you you weren't magical. And then the skeptic challenges the woman to use her magic to lower the dude's blood pressure and prove they can fucking do what they say they can do. And she's like, hell no. She don't want any part of it. She's like, let that motherfucker heal himself. And so the dude con man knows he's fucked. He knows he ain't got no goddamn magical powers. But what the fuck's he gonna do? He can't admit that he's a fucking con man who's been stealing money from people. So he's just gotta keep going along with the con. So he's like, nah, really, I am magical. Watch this, I'm gonna lower my fucking blood pressure. And he waves his hand over his arm and shit. Dude turns the machine back on and the guy's sitting there desperately trying to lower his goddamn blood pressure before the machine goes off again. But unfortunately for him, he's not fucking magical. And the machine goes off again and this time his blood pressure is 208 over 108. Which is so high that the skeptic is like, dude, we need to call this guy an ambulance right now. That's how fucking serious it is. 208 over 108 is 911 territory. And so the skeptic guy finishes mopping these two motherfuckers up by demanding the television studio immediately call this man an ambulance. Just totally humiliated these two motherfuckers in front of the entire country. It was fucking beautiful. One of the most glorious debunkings I've ever seen live on national television. This video has already gone viral in India and is now starting to go viral in the rest of the world. People having the guts to stand up and call out bullshit like this is incredibly important, especially in developing countries like India who are more susceptible to this type of religious con man. So major shout out to Babu Gojimini, who I'm sure I'm not pronouncing your name right, but you you still fucking rock anyway, dude. Keep up the awesome work, and I salute you with logic. Fuck yes. Hey guys, what's up? Dusty Smith here, and this is Miss Molly. She's a beautiful Roddy girl we rescued from a dog fighting ring. As you guys may know, all my videos are now demonetized on YouTube. So if you're at all able to support us on Patreon, please do. We do a lot of good work. Thanks, guys.